tragedy at this local beach. A man participating in a triathlon died after being pulled from the water. Hundreds of athletes swam, biked, and ran in the race in St. Johns County. News for Jack's reporter Vic Michelucci spoke with a man who tried to save the athlete. Conditions here at Michler's Landing were rough throughout the weekend, just like they are right now. This happened during the swimming portion of the triathlon, and I spoke with a man who did CPR on this racer when it happened. He said everything transpired very quickly, and they tried everything they could. Video shows the competition, triathletes getting in and out of the water on Sunday morning. It's during this part where participants pulled out a swimmer who was unresponsive. Organizers say he was 51, and a medical professional at the event tells me he tried to revive the man with CPR right away. Lifeguards and firefighters taking over, but the athlete died at the hospital. This happened during the game on Ponte Vedra Beach try. The organizers releasing this statement saying he experienced a medical emergency, adding we share our deepest condolences with his family and friends and respect their privacy during this difficult time. Participants and bystanders told us conditions were less than ideal, but there were lifeguards at the event, even though the beach isn't typically guarded during this time of year. It's unclear if these conditions were a factor or not. Typically right now, no, the current's a little bit strong. Uh, waves are a little bit choppy. The weather authority had been watching the situation along our coast. And I pulled up the beach report from yesterday, and right now it says there was a red flag warning along our beaches, high surf and strong rip currents. They reported surf here at the beach around two to four feet. So for some people, that could be some rough surf out there. The event put on by Game On based in Jupiter is overseen by USA Triathlon. We reached out to their leaders for comment. Deaths during triathlons are relatively rare, but they do happen. A man died during the swim portion of an Ironman triathlon in Augusta, Georgia, just two weeks ago. Minnesota Heart Institute Foundation researchers studied triathletes and found 135 have died in the past 31 years. The average victim was 47 years old. Most were male, and two-thirds of the deaths happened during the swim part of the competition. As the investigation into this man's death continues, first responders here in St. John's County are urging people to be careful because the water conditions are still dangerous. At Michaelers, I'm Vic Michelucci, Channel 4, the local station.